Hey, what's up, everyone? Dragon here with Ashley. We're doing another trailer reaction. This one for Detective Pikachu. I have to say it right because I always want to say Pikachu for some reason. Yeah, it's it's like you're Inu Inuwasha. You say Inuwasha. Yeah, I, I don't know why. From way back when, if anybody remembers that show. Yeah, but anyway, so I made sure I said it correctly this time. Yeah. Detective Pikachu. I'm proud. Uh, well, thank you. I shouldn't uh, be, but I am. <laughs> take what you can get with me. <laughs> I'm married to this, damn it. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so we've been hearing about this for a while. It's kind yeah. of a Pokemon movie, I guess, even though it sounds like it just has just Pikachu in it. Uh, That's I know. what I heard. It's based on a game, right? That I yeah, don't... it's a parent. It's a Japanese exclusive game that came out like a couple of years ago now, I think, about like a little boy and Pikachu who has a super deep voice, and they should have got Danny DeVito to play him. <laughs> I know her. For the I was picture Danny DeVito's voice in my head. But anyway, I guess we're going to find out. But yeah, so let's, out. let's see. I'm, I'm kind of like... So, Ryan Reynolds, I think, is the voice of Pikachu in this. Don't want to get blasted away by the sound. Yeah, Ryan Reynolds, Deadpool, is Pikachu, so, you know. Oh, I hope he plays exactly <laughs> like Deadpool. Anyway, here we go. Boom. Welcome to Rhyme City. Well, already there are a fuck ton more Pokemon. Yeah, really, look at them. And wow, Sider, kind of scary. Tim, you and Tad was a legend in this precinct. Turn of the voice. If you uh, anything yep. like Ken Watanabe. Nice. He looks really remember. familiar too. He was in the last you Jurassic World. Oh, yeah. yeah, that didn't really work out. Someone there? Gizmo, is that you? Whoever you are, I know how to use this. That's stupid. Oh, jeez. Oh. Here we go. I know you can't understand me, but put down the stapler or I will electrocute you. <laughs> okay. Did you just talk? Whoa. Did you just understand me? Oh my god, you can understand me. He's so cute. Been so lonely. Oh, they try to talk to me all the time. All they hear is Pika Pika. Uh, you can hear him, right? Pika Pika. Yeah, Pika Pika Pika, he's adorable. You're adorable. They can't understand me, kid. Can no one else hear him? I don't need a Pokemon, period. And what about a world-class detective? Because if you want to find your pops, I'm your best bet. That's Squirtle. We're going to do this, you and me. Wow, seriously, they got all of them. For most of them. Yay, Charizard! Listen up. Oh, we got ways to make you talk. Or mine. Yeah. So tell us what we want to know. Oh, I, God. Yes, okay. I can. Shoving, pushing. My problem is that I push people away and then hate them for leaving. He's saying you can shove it. What? I can shove it? Okay, that's it. No, we're switching roles. I'm bad cop. You're good cop. No, 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 no we're not cops. <laughs> In my head, I saw that differently. Jeez, Charizard looks awesome. Wow, that is very different than I thought it was gonna be. So that's the thing, it's like a legit Pokemon movie then, right? Because yeah. I was first hearing like, okay, they're gonna do it. At first it was like, okay, they're gonna do a Legendary is doing a Pokemon movie. I was like, okay, makes sense, gonna make a lot of money. And then I heard that um, uh, they were doing just Pikachu, and I was like, well, yeah. what's, what's the point of doing a Pokemon if you're only going to have one? And But apparently it looks like this is like a legit Pokemon movie. It's it's a world with Pokemon, but they just made it look a bit more like our world as opposed to a bit more, I guess, the one you see in the game and the anime. But then again, I don't know, the game and the anime is pretty minimalistic. I so. haven't played in a while. I'm trying to remember. I think the last <clears> one <throat> I played was like X and Y. I never see. I never got into the games. I remember when I lived in Okinawa, like it was like ninety seven, ninety eight. The show was was over there. It was before yeah. it came to America. And I was remember watching it in Japanese. They know what was going on. And I, I mean, regardless, like yeah, I thought I had heard that they only were allowing them to use Pikachu mainly, and that's why they were doing the. And the that's why they were doing yeah, Detective Pikachu, because otherwise it's kind of like an odd choice choice. To yeah. do a Japanese exclusive game? Well, something tells me they've <laughs> taken a movie? they've taken a lot of liberty. It doesn't. Yeah. I, I think they basically took the basic premise of the game. But, but I gotta say, like, you know, I wasn't sure how Ryan Reynolds was gonna do it, but that cute 
snarky ass Pikachu, man. And Pikachu looks good. And I, I, they I, all look really good. Which is interesting because obviously Pokemon are rendered very cartoony. Yeah. So when you transfer that into like real life, it's like, okay, how does that work? And they all, they manage to retain their, their look, but they give them like realistic texture. Like Pikachu has yeah. like the fur, so he looks more like, I mean, he still looks he looks cute and fluffy. Yeah, I mean, I'm just waiting for those uh, little figures of like the realistically rendered now Pikachu. <laughs> oh, I know. But no, I mean, it looks good. I mean, I'm not a big Pokemon fan, so for me, it's not like I had a lot right. I mean, on I've, this. I've never, I'm, I'm, I've been a very casual Pokemon fan. I just used to watch the show. Like I in just the 90s, liked playing the games and collecting the Pokemon I liked. Yeah, but I wasn't like Psycho and had to get everything shiny and. Not like, that there's the anything wrong with that. Breeding. We have there friends. There definitely isn't. We have friends that are like we, that, so see we're not the knocking. Toll it takes. <laughs> yeah, we're <real ass. laughs> That's why I stay cash. <laughs> but yeah, so but the point is, we know that for a yeah. lot of you out there, you had a lot riding on, and this is a very big deal. In fact, it looks. Uh, I, I I can't believe I'm saying this after all the fun I've made of it, but it looks good. It looks really good. Well, it looks like I they wanted... made like a legit Pokemon movie, as opposed to this weird like offshoot thing, which sounded like what they were making well, initially. Which I was and just kind of like those things where it, it, I feel like it was it was. It was either going to be a hit or a miss, and maybe it will be. Maybe it's just a really good trailer, but like, it looks really good. <laughs> yeah, but I like how they kind of explain why Pikachu sounds that way. They like basically, it, it, it's kind of like, it's how you can make him sound that way without. Even though I'm curious to find out why he can hear him and no one else can. Unless, well, it was always one of the things. Like, even like your trainer, maybe you have that that bond where it's like if you when oh, you yeah, make that bond. Oh yeah, there was that one movie. There was one animated movie where Ash was like dying, and apparently he heard Pikachu talk to him. I think it's like if you form a strong enough bond, you can know. hear him. But it's like to our ears, Pikachu is still doing that the normal Pika Pika voice. Yeah. But what was that? What? Give me your best. Excuse me. Give me your best Pika. -pika. I'm sorry. What? Okay. But uh. Lame. I, and again, I don't know much, too much about uh, Pokemon, but I do know I like I love Tyrantrum, so maybe we'll get Tyrantrum in the movie because I think he looks awesome. But yeah, no, we got a couple of friends that are like, you know, they're in deep. Yeah, they're in, they're in <laughs> deep, deep, deep. They live, eat, and breathe. They just swan dive into that <laughs> rabbit hole. Um, so I'm very curious to hear what they think about it because again, to me, it looks good. But if you're a hardcore Pokemon fan, I don't, I don't know. Like, yeah. I don't know. You guys might be looking at this going, this is blasphemy. What? But I don't know. So, you know, what do you guys think about it? Does this look good? Well, and I like that it doesn't look like it's just like a kitty movie. It looks like it's legit, like a, a legit movie. Yeah. Not like it's like, oh, we got to pander to the children. Well, Even we... though it's like, look at the Pokemon demographic. It's mostly people. Everyone I know who plays Pokemon, <laughs> I think the youngest person that I know who plays Pokemon is 25. Yeah. Okay. Everybody else I know who plays is in their 30s yeah. and 40s. So I'm people just kind of like, up with it. you could make it an R rated movie and this movie would still be number one at the box office. Yeah. And because, like, it'd be every freaking adult going to see it. <laughs> <laughs> and then they bring their kids. Yeah, yeah I, th so. see, I, I think honestly, I think a PG thirteen might have been a nice middle of the road, like like a lighter yeah. end PG thirteen, but just yeah. so you can kind of ham it up a little bit more for the adults. But they're gonna go PG with it. But I'm hoping you got they, Ryan Reynolds as Pikachu. Yeah, but you I'm hoping gotta have some wheel room. I'm hoping they push the PG yeah. the PG at least get it like hovering right by that PG thirteen mark, just yeah. so we can kind of maybe you know an R rated director's cut. Well, I don't that's know. The thing. There's, there's plenty of PG movies that don't feel like, oh, we're PG. You know what I mean? So yeah, which I don't. Th I think as long as you don't. I mean, as long as you're not swearing. Yeah. And there's not like innuendos. I was thinking like the Harry can... Potter movies. Aren't those PG thirteen? Well, the 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 few end ones were. Yeah. I guess, but yeah, I, I the think earlier the, ones weren't. Again, as long as they make it a movie for like all audiences without making it like a kids movie, yeah. I think that's the way to go. Because when you have movies that are just legit, just yeah, for kids. They, well, yeah. It's yeah, but if you make a movie where it's I like know. adults can enjoy it, then yeah. For the first trailer, I it's definitely reversed my thought of this movie. I <laughs> thought it was going to be trash. I'm going to be uh, honest. So I mean, I think a lot of it comes down to Ryan Reynolds' performance as Pikachu, and I like what they're doing with it. Even though when I well, heard it was him, I was like, okay, I think I see where they're going with it. And I, as long as I just wasn't sure, Pikachu is a lot sassier than I pictured. Because from the the very very little, and I might be wrong, I've seen about the Japanese Pikachu in the game. Again, he had a super deep gruff voice, and he seemed kind of more like the grizzled detective. Whereas this, they're playing it more like again snarky ass. Well, it might be just kind of cultural norms. I might think yeah. it's kind of funny because I think I think they're playing in both both versions are playing against type. Yeah, Where both Pikachu is always Pikachu is also this very cutesy little character. So you could either make him like really gruff and old, like you know. And again, I've just seen very limited gameplay of it, so maybe I'm wrong. Anyways, it would but... have an old man Logan vibe, or yeah. you could make him with just like a sassy. <laughs> character where it's like all the stuff 
happy. Well, it's funny because basically everything we think is makes him cute is what makes him ironic because yeah. he's like it's almost like he's now aware of how people see him and he's yeah. kind of like yeah everyone sees me as this but I'm really like this so it's kind of the they're having fun with the yeah. image I don't of know, Pikachu. Man. I don't know. It looks good. Yeah. Charizard looks awesome. So. I'm very curious. I want, I want to see more Pokemon in the next trailer. I want to see more of like this well, world. Well, as it is, we saw a lot. I'm surprised yeah. already, but... God, how much did this movie cost him with all those licensing? It's like, Jesus Christ. But anyway, but yeah, so what did you guys think? Are you guys excited about this? Were you on the fence about this before? Were you dreading this? And now see this, you're like, oh, okay. Do you still not care? Do, was this maybe not even on your radar? Did you even know they were making this movie? <laughs> uh, anyway, give us some of your thoughts. Again, if you guys are like really into Pokemon, let us know. Does this look good? Because as... Casual fan, we will and we'll find out from our friend who is obsessed with yeah, Pokemon soon. But. And guy who watched anime in the nineties, I it looks like a good movie to me, yeah. but I don't know if this counts as a good Pokemon movie. Yeah. So let us know, give some of your thoughts, and as always, we'll catch you in the next one. Peace.